welcome to you guys and comes with another video so the video about how to use the dropbox so before going to dropbox so just we need to so discuss about the dropbox the dropbox is the cloud storage you can store your photos and perform and the personal files are on the cloud so so first of all open your browser and we find dropbox so just we see the features of dropbox so you can found that dropbox works the way you do and take your documents anywhere so you can access your computer or a desktop or a mobile phone whatever it may be and send videos quickly and keep your photos safe and these are the the features of dropbox so first of all you must need to create an account enter the full name and email and the password so it is the free and basic plan and already have an account so that's why i want to sign in yeah this is the dropbox home page in this dropbox home page we will find top section and left sidebar and this is the main dropbox body up body part in this body part we will find all your documents which you are uploaded files you can found in the body part you will find body part. so let's we discuss about each and section of a drop files means top view and left sidebar and about the body so first we start with the top view so in the top view here you find upload so you can upload your files just click on the upload tab so choose the files so you can choose any one of the files so i want to choose one mp3 song okay so now it is uploading so you find so it is uploading one minute left so you can add more files so i want to hide this one so i want to hide next you find create new folder so i want to create a new folder about the songs songs so when i completed the song i want to move it to i want to move this song into the songs folder okay are you getting my point so i want to show you how to move this so first of all open this folder so folder is empty So Dropbox, here you will find the song, just simply drag and songs. So now you will find in the songs, Krishna ni Vega ni Bharat. So that is the song. And you find another one that is share your folder. So you can share directly your folder with your friends or colleagues. So I would like to create new folder or a, you can share existing folder. So I want to share existing folder. So that's why I click on I did like to share an existing folder then click on the next. So these are the folders in my Dropbox. So this is the I want to select this folder and then to click on next and invite your friends and invite your friends. I think I'm not connected with any other friends so that's why I don't have any friends. You can directly enter your email, email, Gmail, so, and type um, message and share folder with your friends. Just click on the share folder. So that is about share folder, and you can delete files with this one. So show delete files. Just click on. Otherwise, you can just. I will show you how to delete. So just right click on the uploaded file and you find different options comment download move rename or whatever it may be so you find the delete option so you can perform the the delete operation also and another you can find found search box so if your dropbox having more files then you need to search the those files and you can up so this is the the basic plan of the Dropbox and you can it upgrade at any time pro array the business plans. So just click on the 
upgrade button so pro and business plans in this pro so nine dollars per month and dropbox as 15 dollars per month okay but in basic question just will give the 2 gb of space but in coming to the pro version 1 tb of space and the dropbox in business aspect too we can unlimited space so that is about the difference between the basic plan pro and business and here you find some icon like notifications icon so if you want for uh, send any notifications or any files the from your friends and you can find the notification here and if you find one your username so my username is Ganesh so in this you can find first your name username and you can add your photo and this is your gmail and how much space you are used in the drop bags so i'm already used 900 so nearly 850 mb so next we find settings and install drop bags on windows operating system or macintosh mac or whatever it may be so sign out so these are available in so these are all switch between the username account so i'm already talking about uh, so so that is about the top view and and we need to more discuss about the body part so this is one of my uploaded folder when you click on this folder so again we have to select the folder then when you when you click on this just right click on this in this directly you can share with your friends through this so already i'm told you about the top view you can share your folders so i don't want to share your folders i want to share the particular file in that what in this case what happened so you can select any one of the file and right click on the file you can share with your friends so just click on the share share so like this so so what happened so like enter your email and message and send it to your friend so that is about and not only a uh, only delete operation we perform a lot of operations like download so it is in cloud so you can now download into your pc or disk then when you click on download or you can place it so the comment for that document you can press the comment and perform the delete or a rename or a move so move to another folder or a copy to another folder so like that so that is about the body part and comes with the left side bar in the left side bar you found one thing that is about the recents recents means so the recent files will be displayed so recently watch for the, the perform the operations or whatever it may be so recently uploaded files are any recently uploaded files or a, any operations performed on the files those files will be displayed in the top position so next click on the files so it will show the all the all the files in your dropbox so just like a body part it will display all the files all the files are involved in your dropbox so upload files will be displayed next we found team so you can create a team and you can share with your team so already if you have any documents and and you are running any so running a business or a company so if you want to share the documents with your clients and at a time and first of all we need to create a one team in this, in this team first we need to so first we have to enter your email address and send invitation to your workers or the employees and so just you find the create a team the first company name and invite already told you to invite the people and enter your emails and send a message and create a team okay so that is about how to create a team and after creating a team so you can directly share with your documents with your colleagues colleagues so whatever it may be so i want uh, next we found paper paper so paper means it's simply like a google documents google docs and the evernote 
generally uh, you can find I think it is not available for a basic version I think a uh, drop box per paper beta so it is under the conversion maybe so it is maybe so it is like a Google Docs and Evernote so if you want to know about Evernote you can see my previous videos and just like a Evernote and Google Docs Google Docs just so how to it is how to use the paper means you can create documents and notes I presentations so you can share with your friends so directly with the paper and as um, what I'm expecting means I think the paper is more better than the Weber note and Google Docs in the future I know this so uh, I think I'm expecting like that and you can find next in the dust file we find we found photos when you click on the photos it will displace all your photos what you are uploaded photos so that will be displayed here so you find this are so these are all photos I'm upload I found all your all my photos here you guys we found this next go back next already I'm told about sharing so I'm told about in the, uh, top top view I'm also uh, so talking about sharing at the body of the view I'm already so talking about sharing so I want to see once again sharing so new shared folder you click on the shared folder just like I'm told about you can create a new folder or share existing folders so next links so we talking about we talk about links in this links so we can create a link to any file or a folder so simply I want to show you so I, uh, now I don't have any links so just already in this photos in this files maybe in this files I'm already see uh, open the documents in this documents uh, I want to go back funny so this is the link okay guys this is the link so this link you can share with your friends not only a folder you can also share with your link so you found people with the link can view using that view the people can the people can see your photos so simply when you click on the share button so you automatically create a link okay if one so this is the link so that is about links okay so that is the the creation of a link next you found events so so events nothing but so it will display the all your documents so which type of documents means if you have, if you performed any i think so if you perform anything on the dropbox and recently so those files are displayed so events given timeline to changes to your dropbox so you move the file so i want to move the file from uh, i think one song moved from another folder and uploaded one folder and so like that a creative folder so like that like that events will be displayed at the event section and you find file request and one other thing about the file request so file request means so I think this is the one of the greatest feature in the Dropbox so introducing the file request invite anyone to upload files to your in Dropbox so my Dropbox if if they don't have any account so if my my friends want to send some files to my Dropbox without having any account so those files my friends also send files to my account so that is about the creative file request first we need to create a one file request so I want to request something to my friends so birthday party photos or uh, any other documents what it may be the first I want to give a request and choose the folder and click on the next so simply photos photos okay and I'm click on the next so next I want to enter the email for my 
email so my friends email okay after then and add a message and click on send so this invitation will be go to my friends and my friends using this link in this link and my friends send files to me so that is about file request so you can found this i'm already so create one folder photos and you can add the people you can add the people so and one more thing you find that is so the deleted files in this digital files so if you so if you need to any one of the file from your dropbox so that will be stored in the trash array or the deleted files so after 30 days after 30 days they automatically so permanently so permanently delete from your account okay and before 30 days you can move to your workspace otherwise after 30 days those are the permanently delete from your account so thank you friends and thanks for watching and please subscribe my videos and keep supporting on me thank you friends thank you once again subscribe now